Joining me now is Thomas Behrens, retired command sergeant major for the Minnesota National Guard. Uh, Thomas, good to have you with us tonight. Now, J.D. Vance is saying this is a case of stolen valor. He obviously served in the Marine Corps uh, in active duty. Uh, what is your take on this? Is this just, you know, a casual mistake? Is this something far darker? That's far, way far darker than uh, than a lot of people think. I mean, it, it is stolen valor. He's used he's used the rank that he never achieved in order to uh, advance his political career. He's done it for decades now, basically. I mean, maybe not decades, but damn close to it. I mean, he's he still says he's a retired command sergeant major to this day, and and he's not. He he uh, he uses his rank uses rank of others to make it look like he's a better person than he is. He still does it even, you know, just however long ago. Well, to that point, just so everyone understands what we're talking about here, um, on his biography, on his campaign website, and even on the Minnesota website, it lists him, uh, Governor Waltz, as a, for, as a retired command sergeant major. And his governor's bio says the same thing. It even says that that is the rank he retired at. I mean, that's just a fact. You did or didn't. But again, the Minnesota National Guard told the angle he retired as a master sergeant. Now, to, for people who don't have any military background, they might think, oh, command, you know, sergeant major, master sergeant. Why is that such a big deal? Tell us why that's such a big deal. Well, it, it's a big deal for the simple fact that in order to, you, when you get conditionally promoted to command sergeant major or sergeant major, you're, you're signing a document that states that you will complete the United States Army Sergeant Majors Academy, which which is technically a two-year course, two-year college course almost. And if you don't complete that, you don't you don't get the rank. So you basically get reduced. You're, you know, it's a it's conditional. You get pinned with E9, but then it gets taken away from you when you either quit or you end up having, having uh, you know, don't complete the course. So what he did basically was he quit. He didn't complete that condition. He didn't complete the condition of doing two years after graduation. So he gets reduced to a master sergeant. And that's what he is right now as a retired master sergeant. 